grand performance, USA, the greatest entertainers in America, as requested by you, the servicemen and women of the United States Armed Forces throughout the world. Command performance presented this week and every week till it's over, over there. Okay there, gang, get out the blankets and the bones. Command performance is shooting that lucky seven. Yes, sir, tonight seven big stars are shooting for all APO and FPO numbers in answer to your letters to Command Performance, Armed Forces Radio, Los Angeles, USA. So get down there on the floor and let's roll with your master of ceremonies, Don Amici. Boys, it's all fine and dandy, Carmen Mirandy, she's singing for you. Cute little Faye McKenzie, she's here too. And Cass Daly's got plenty to do. Gee, it's all fine and dandy. Join Jan Pierce right from Carnegie Hall. Plus, the Pioneers and Roy Rogers, too. Command performance coming through. And I mean coming, fellas. First, we're turning on the international stop-and-go sign for you to stop for a quick minute and listen to the Armed Forces Radio Orchestra Trio knocking you a 16-millimeter version of one of your big request tunes, Out of Nowhere. Away we go. Hello to my Shining Hour to Vault 957. To that British MTB trio, Sparks, Docky, and Barney. Regards, Lieutenant Bill Piney and your dugout at 37. Our best to Torpedo Unit 23, including Hophead, Weedy, Wolf, Gasket Head, Rock Time, and Sack Time. <laughs> at 638, the same to the Joe Dokes of the Air Force, Steve, LSO, Shadrach, and Available Valentine. <laughs> Hello to the Isle of Capri and to the guy in Naples who claims to be the world's champion at Harlem Tennis. Also, eight ball in the side pocket, Walters. <laughs> and for thousands of you in the Caribbean and around the world who asked for a certain pinup picture to come to life, here she is, Faye McKenzie. <laughs> Hello, Faye. Tell them what you're serving tonight. Thanks, Don. Hi, fellas. It's one part Spanish, one part English, and all parts of the GI globe. That's well tuned. They saw me mucho.
Bésame, bésame mucho Como si fuera esta noche la última vez Bésame mucho Que tengo miedo perderte, perderte otra vez Quiero tenerte muy cerca, mirarme en tus ojos, verte junto a mí. Piensa que tal vez mañana yo ya estaré lejos, muy lejos de ti. Dearest one, if you should leave me, Each little dream would take wing and my life would be through. Mucho. Love me forever and make all my dreams come true. And make all my dreams come true. Thank you, Ray McKenzie. And saddle up there, fellows. We're riding the international panhandle with Roy Rogers and the Sons of the Pioneers. To fill command performance orders from Navy Sam Stanley. Hut 18 in Iceland, Lauren Medill in the Canadian Army, and the WAF Balloonatics at Wanstead, London. And our old friends from way back, the Joe Pot Gang. Hope that silver Joe Pot is still perking out there. But here comes the King of the Cowboys and his musical posse, Roy Rogers and Bob Nolan and the Sons of the Pioneers. <laughs> Well, thank you, Don, and howdy, men. My saddle pals, uh, Bob Nolan and the Sons of the Pioneers, would like to dig you a famous tune out of the old Western songbook. It's called Salute the Lindo. Take her away, boys. Ay, 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 canta el oyole, porque cantando se alegra el cielito lindo los corazones. De la sierra morena, cielito lindo, vienen bajando Un par de ojitos negros, cielito lindo, can robando Ay, 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 <risa> canta en no llores Porque cantando se alegra el cielito lindo, los corazones In Mexico, where the breezes blow, there are bound to go here is the love I bring you, Cielito Lindo, my own amorcita. Ay, 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 <laughs> canta y no llore, porque cantando se alegran, Cielito Lindo, los corazones. Well, thank you, fellas, and I reckon from the command performance fan mail that nobody will get too mad if I kind of crowd in with the sons of the pioneers and we all get together and do a tune called When My Blue Moon Turns to Gold Again. When my blue moon turns to gold again When the rainbow turns the clouds away my blue moon turns to gold again You'll be back in my arms to stay Memories that linger in my heart Memories that make my heart grow cold 
But someday they'll live again, sweetheart And my blue moon again will turn to gold When my blue moon turns to gold again When the rainbow turns the clouds away When my blue moon turns to gold again Back in my arms to stay The lips that used to thrill me so Your kisses were meant for only me In my dreams they live again, sweetheart But my golden moon is just a memory When my blue moon turns to gold again When the rainbow turns the clouds away When my blue moon turns to gold again You'll be back in my arms to stay Thanks, Roy Rogers and the Sons of the Pioneers. Comes now a little surprise for the Hut 2-4 gang at 980, Mike the Boss, Scotty, Arnie, and the Mob. Mother Sloan and his fighter chicks at 959. Private Pete Rambalski at 729 and at 728 for a group of intellectuals who sign off as Greasy, Skinner, Slim, Moe, Groundhog, Sparks, Slinky, and Stinky. <laughs> also for Ward 3 at 2nd General at 647. Quartermaster Alan Hanley or Hawley at 680. Blue Eye, Habazine, BLO, Bub, and Trombula at 528. Not only a surprise, fellas, but something of a shock, but always a pleasant shock. It's that gorgeous, glamorous, Sirene of the Silver Screen, Cass Daly. <laughs> Well, now, pardon me, Mr. Amici, but you've got my name wrong. It's not Cass Daly. It's Cass G. Daly. What's the G for? Gladstone 3124. <laughs> well, uh, I-, I don't get you. You will if you try. <laughs> For this, I had to invent the telephone. <laughs> but Cash, you know, I was worried. Uh, why were you so late coming down? Oh, I was here having my hair done at Westmore's. Oh, at Westmore's, no less. Yeah, it should be here any minute. I don't know what's... <laughs> oh, that's nice. Uh, what color are you having it done this year? Oh, the same old thing. Plaid. <laughs> well, I suppose there's a reason for all this renovation. Warm weather is here, huh? Yeah. Oh, gee, how romantic. You know, it's the time of the year that every girl should find her ideal man. Yeah, yeah, that's right, Cass. And uh, uh, tell me, confidentially, uh, uh, what kind of a man do you want? Well, I... I... Uh, I want a man... Uh, I... I want a man that... Uh, yes? That's all. I just want a man. <laughs> well, that kind of sounds like a full-time project. Well, now, just a minute, Mr. Amici. I'll have you know I've been asked to get married lots of times. Who asked you? My mother and father. (laughs) (laughs) Ah, now, look, Cass, romance isn't everything. There's some things that are more important than men. What's that? I said some things are more important than men. (laughs) Oh, silly boy, (laughs) isn't he? For instance, athletics, tennis, golf, riding. Ah, oh, how right you are, Don. You're absolutely right. In fact, this morning I was horseback riding for two hours. Side saddle. Side saddle? Sure, I always ride side saddle. Why? Well, it saves a little place where you can sit down the next day, you know. <laughs> that's, uh, that's a tender subject. <laughs> Not kidding. Ah, <laughs> oh, but Don, to get back to ro- romance. You know, 
I do have a boyfriend. He's a Marine. Oh, well, that's fine. A Marine, huh? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh. He used to be a carpenter. Why, uh, how do you know? Well, as soon as we were alone, he made a bolt for the door. I mean, I don't... <laughs> had a wonderful time last night. We went to movies, dancing, and, and then then he took me home in a cab. A Marine in a cab? Yeah. Huh. Uh, did he uh, get romantic? Uh, I mean, did you have any trouble? I certainly did, Don. I had to bite him and kick him and punch him and scratch him. And then what happened? Well, then I knocked him out and kissed him. I mean... <laughs> first... Well, Cass, enough of that. Let's knock ourselves out on a song. Gee, you mean you and I? Uh, I mean, let's you. Oh... Oh, well, fellas, I'm not interested in men anyway, as you will see from my little song, if you please. (laughs) It cost me a lot, but there's one thing that I've got. It's a maid. It's a maid. Twenty-three jobs had she Just before she came to me Did my maid, did my maid She's not much for looks And it's brutal how she cooks What a maid, what a maid She's untidy, you bet And those things I can't forget But I need her I don't know why I should She isn't good She hates to work All work she'll shirk She is a jerk (laughs) But my maid I need her so She'll never know That my life Was in despair Till she came there And the day she came my way the world was bright. All right. All right, Mallory! What's the difference if she says she'll go away? She can't leave me, cause I owe her six months' pay. So whatever my maid is, she is mine forever, forever more. Ah, my maid, what a character. She breaks the dishes, clogs the sink, and on her day off, she wears my mink. She refuses to dust or run the sweeper, and foot by foot, the dirt is getting deeper. And if I even mention laundry, there's a terrific feud. And if I give a party, she's the one that gets stewed. (laughs) She eats night and day, and I mean steady. But only serves me when she's darn good and ready. She has about six or seven boyfriends and asks them all for dinner. Everybody come. (laughs) Using my points and I'm getting thinner. (laughs) She plays the radio till I think I'll go wacky. You know something? I suspect the kid chews tobacco. (laughs) And this'll kill you. She says she's 21, just reaching maturity. (laughs) I'll bet the old bag's old enough to collect her social security. (laughs) And last night, last night was really the topper, old man. She put on bobby socks and became a Sinatra fan. (laughs) But whatever my maid is, she is mine forever. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you, Cass Daly. And with such great music as their on-command performance, it is only natural that we should have one of America's greatest tenors with us tonight. All of you know Jan Pierce. Not so much from the jukeboxes as from institutions like the Metropolitan Opera, the concert stage, and the radio. When Mr. Pierce popped into Hollywood for a two-night stand, we confronted him with a mess of your letters, asking him for one of your all-time favorite songs. 
Command Performance proudly presents Jan Pierce. Thank you, Don Amici, and thanks to you men and women in the armed forces all over the world. Those letters Don spoke of ran heavily to the serenade from the student prince, and it's my sincere pleasure to sing it on this big show of yours. on the bough Nothing is heard but the song of a bird Filling all the air with dreaming But my heart still is singing Only you can tell My soul, my joy, my hope, my fear Your heart must tell you that I am near Lean from above while I pour out my love For you know to my life you are love Oh, hear my longing cry Oh, love me before I die Overhead the moon is beating On the bow Nothing is heard But the song of the birds Filling all the air With dreaming Could my heart But still it's beating Oh At Pinderfields Hospital in England, the boys are sweating out Carmen Miranda. Well, they can sit back right now and listen to their favorite five foot two of oomph. Carmen's on deck two for Private Benny Kransdorf at APO4, for Vincent D'Antona at 259, for that gang of you listening on the Anzio Beachhead. But especially, there's something Carmen has in mind to salute every CB who still carries in his heart the memory of a buddy in the old 1st Defense Battalion those CBs who did so nobly at Wake and Midway. Fellas, here's one of Command Performance's favorite girls, Carmen Miranda. Hello.
Hello, boys, and love to every one of you everywhere. I'd like very much to sing for you a Brazilian march. It's called Toradas in Madrid. Bullfight in Madrid. <laughs> Estouradas em Madrid, para ti pum pum, para ti pum pum. E quase não volto mais aqui para ver Peri. Veja se se para ti pum pum, para ti pum pum. Eu conheci uma espanhola naturada Catalunha. Queria que eu tocasse castanhola, que pegasse touro a unha. Caramba, caracol, isso do samba não me amores pro Brasil. Eu vou fugir, que isso é conversa mole para boi dormir. Para ti, para ti, eu fui às toradas em Madrid. Para ti, pum pum, para ti, pum pum. E quase não volto mais aqui para ver Peri. Beija se se para ti, pum pum, para ti, pum. Eu conheci uma espanhola natural da Catalunha. Queria que eu tocasse castanhola, que pegasse toro a unha. Caramba, caracoles do samba não me amores pro Brasil. Eu vou fugir, que sua conversa mole para boi dormir. Para ti pum pum, para ti pum pum, para ti pum pum, para ti pum pum. Thank you, Carmen Miranda Lopez and all the boys who worked with you. And fellas, that about winds up the last half of the ninth on command performance, and we'll be batting out the stuff for you every week until the day comes when you guys round home plate with a winning run. This is Don Amici with a sincere thank you from the gang at home, wishing you the best of the best from the USA. So long, fellas. <laughs> This is Ken Carpenter hanging out the closing sign saying that command performance is arranged in cooperation with the Hollywood Victory Committee and produced by the Armed Forces of the United Nations by the Armed Forces Radio Service.